I'm Jessica, an e-learning specialist, and I'm here to give you a little trick on how to add blank rows between populated rows in Excel. So you can see I have a, uh, a file here that has a lot of data in it, and I could simply go through and I could insert, and there I've got my blank row between my um, rows that have data inside, and I could do this, but if you have a large file, this is gonna take a while. So I'm gonna Control-Z out of that and show you a quick tip. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna insert a column, that simple, and then I'm gonna number these rows. So in this case, I'm gonna just put in one and control drag all the way down to the bottom. And then while it's still highlighted, I'm gonna copy, so I'm gonna type control C, and then control V to paste, and you'll see now I have one through 17 listed again. Click at the top of this column, Sort and filter, sort A to Z, and check that out. I got a blank a row between every uh, populated row. I now delete this column to go back to my original spot. Quick and easy and done. Hope that helps.